Another option built into WooCommerce is a flat rate. For flat rate, you charge a single fee regardless of distance or weight, and you can modify it based on the number of items. Let's take a quick peek at that. Yeah, back over to our store, settings, and shipping, and let's add a new flat rate. So once again, I'm going to click on local, add a shipping method, flat rate, and click edit. So our flat rate is taxable, and once again, we need to figure out a cost. Hovering over that little question mark, we can see how this works. So you can take $10 times the quantity, and that's a square bracket QTY, or you can even make it more complex. For instance, at the bottom here, cost for the total cost of items and fee, minimum fee equals 20 max fee for percentage base fees. It looks something like this. So $10 plus two times the QTY is going to give me a flat rate of $10 plus $2 per item. So if I have two items in my cart, that's going to be a $14 total flat rate shipping fee. Click Save Changes. So while you can set this up manually, one of the things we recommend is if you're not in the United States, so for instance in Canada, there is probably an excellent shipping provider plugin for your country. I want to recommend that you go take a look at those and choose the one that's right for you. In the next section, we're going to talk about taxes. And usually, this is the most complex topic for any e-commerce setup. But WooCommerce makes it manageable.